saw an interesting piece of history. When I left six years ago, the factor was averaging close to 4 million viewers at 8 o'clock and another two at 11 o'clock for our rerun. That's 6 million people, right? No cable program has approached that, all right, since I left, because that's a pretty lofty number. Carlson took over for me in the first two years. He lost about a million of my viewers. Okay, he was doing around three to eight, two million eight hundred thousand. Then he made a very shrewd decision. And Tucker Carlson himself is a smart man and a talented broadcaster. Anybody who thinks he isn't is a fool. I mean, he knows what he's doing on television. So he decided to go to get viewers from the committed right, all right, a lot like Rush Limbaugh did. And he went into that precinct and he programmed for those Americans. His base was about three million people, which in this day and age puts him ahead of most other uh, cable news outfits. Okay. So, but in doing that, his commentary became in many cases, conspiratorial. And again, you can make a lot of money doing that. And there's nothing wrong with doing that as long as you tell people, this is my opinion, it's speculation, but this is what I think. There's nothing wrong with that. I don't disparage that. I'm a hard news guy. My opinions are based on facts. But the conspiracy industry is huge. Russian collusion. I mean, that was insane in every news organization except Fox embraced that conspiracy. Did they not? Okay. So Carlson had a very successful run at Fox and was very influential among committed conservatives. They're different than casual conservatives. They're right there every day. Okay. Want to know what uh, is going on. At the same time, Fox News changed dramatically from a tightly structured operation run by a guy named Roger Ailes, who is no longer there, to what they call fiefdoms. Each show did its own thing. And it maintained its lead over CNN, completely hapless. And MSNBC, which is as crazy left as you can get. Thank you for watching the No Spin News. To watch the full episode anytime on BillOReilly.com, please sign up to become a premium or concierge member. Visit BillOReilly.com to sign up and start watching today.